Thank you. What's up guys, it's Gabe here. Welcome back to another video. I'm here with my boy Daniel. And you can guys probably already see where we're sitting. Uh, because of Daniel, I was able to come today. Originally I wasn't, so thank you Daniel for uh, hooking me up with the seats here. And uh, we are here in the lounge seats area. Usually I come here with my parents, but today we're here with Daniel. Check it out. We're a little bit far farther back, but it's cool because it's a little bit sunny out here, pretty hot. So we're gonna chill with this overhang that's going on here. But uh, today we are here for game two of this three game set against the Cincinnati Reds. Last night there was a protest in Oakland uh, in front of the uh, Coliseum Bar Bridge. I was a part of it and here's a couple of clips from that. Pretty interesting. Uh, a lot of Ace fans came out um, and you know even during the uh, during the game as the game went on there was a bunch of people come walking around uh, from the right field crew and they were just you know wearing cell shirts and they were chanting uh, sell the team Fisher sucks anything like that and you know they did a good job and shout out to those guys but today I'm here to relax try to move away from my section over there in the bleachers we're gonna try to enjoy this game and hopefully we can see a win Daniel it's been a while. It's been a while since we've seen a win here at the Coliseum. I think, honestly, I think the last time I saw one was opening day. If you guys saw the video yet, uh, yesterday before I posted my main video, it was uh, me talking about how the MLB was trying to censor some of the A's fans out there in right field with all the signs. They made a crazy edit on their own website and used that instead. And um, as of right now, a couple minutes ago, uh, they actually fixed it and they released a statement. It's ridiculous. They got caught. They know they got caught. It didn't make them look good, so they fixed it. Let's go, Kyle. Foul territory makes the catch for the out and challenging is Stevenson. They have him by 20 feet. He's out at third. Why did they never learn? I'm tired of this, bro. Yep, that only means one thing Ramon Laureano's back. He dropped the ball. Let's go. As one would say, our, the most person, the person that we hate right now. Ducks in the pond. Sell. Sell. Runners on second and third. With two outs. Come on, Diaz. Oh! Hey! That's a run for the A's. They're on the board early. Let's go, sir. Let's go. All right, Jordan Diaz. We got runners on the corners. Do something with it, please. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah! Here we go. Oh, that's only one run. We got another one. Let's go. Keep adding on. All right, well, Aled Diaz is now out of this game. So Kevin Smith now is taking over. Dang. Well, we got two. Well, that's a home run for the Cincinnati Reds. Don't know this guy's name. That landed right over there in my seats, really. Kind of near my seat. Alright guys, so we just came back from the team store. Dale's rocking some new merch here. Looks pretty cool. It's the new hoodie that they do every year. And we come back thinking like the game, like you know, the game's still going. And we just see the grounds crew out here and they're just stopping on the, the mound out. See, they're already walking off the field now, but I guess there was an issue for Hunter Green. He did not like how, you know, the mound was. So a little delay in the game real quick, but it looks like everything's good. Here we go. We got some ducks on the pond. We got bases loaded. Oh, now. Well, 
there's that two outs. Come on, Rooker. Dang, I feel like we're seeing this a lot today. Nobody scores. Daniel, how do you like that? Is that bad? You feel a little indecisive today. You know why I say that? You didn't want to finish it? <laughs> Why'd you just leave the little bit of the sausage there? I wanted to watch the game. R.I.P. <laughs> Ryan Noda. Root, root, root for the A's. If they don't stay, I'll be pissed. Alright guys, we're going down to the bottom of the seventh inning. The A's are currently winning 2-1. to one, And I'm, not, I'm trying not to keep my hopes up here. I'm just hoping, you know, they hold on. Daniel, we might see a win. Fingers crossed. I'll tell. Daniel, we've seen this too many times today. Are they actually going to score this time? No? Ooh. Oh my. Come on, Ramon. Oh, that's, oh, that's over here. That's right here. No. On the bright side, we're still winning, for now. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going down to the top of the ninth inning. The A's need three outs to get a win. All right, we already got one out, thanks to Familia's strikeout to start off this inning. We need one more here. And we get a walk. Oh, boy. We got a runner on first with one out. Oh, don't play, please. Dang it. I feel like this is where it goes down. Runners on first and second with only one out. He's about to walk this guy. And he did. A double play would be nice right here for Melia. Bases are loaded with only one out here. There's two. Please. One more. Come on, guys. No. Yep. Too good to be true. This one pitch messed it all up. And all the Cincinnati Reds fans are all excited. Literally, three to two. They just, wow. Unbelievable. Now these guys get the last shot that they needed. So frustrating, man. Well, guys, it looks like it's up to Brent Rooker. Can he tie this game up? Keep it going? Yep. There it is. The Reds complete the comeback. Cincinnati wins three to two and take pretty much the series. This is terrible, man. Sell the team, Fisher. All right, guys, well, this is where I'm gonna end my video. The Oakland Athletics lose once again to the Cincinnati Reds, three to two. They were so close, but of course, something like that would happen to the A's. Bounced off the glove of Ryan Noda, and it goes down the line, and two runs score. Ultimately, that sucks, but it is what it is. Sell the team, John. Next time you'll see me, I'll probably be here uh, during the week. Uh, the Seattle Mariners will be in town, and things should be fun then, hopefully, um, autograph-wise and bobblehead-wise. So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like on this video, subscribe if you're new. Don't forget guys, life begins at the end of your comfort zone. I'll see you guys on Monday against the Seattle Mariners. Peace out, y'all.